Yo, I ain't here for the money, I ain't here for the fame Though it might be nice to own a jet plane, I'ma do it all for you A Pokemon from 300 million years ago has been restored into the present day. Genesis. The rage of this mysterious Pokemon is about to be unleashed on the city. Welcome back to Rainers, Battlers, and Girls at PvP. This is Pogo Joe here coming at you with my Genesect Raid Guide video. The Shiny is now out. Yes, I'm super excited for Genesect to be out. And if you haven't heard of me before, I'm Pogo Joel. I come up with event guides, tips and tricks videos, and some PvP content. Now, with Genesect coming out for the first time in raids, we can all be super hyped at getting this new shiny. It's red. It looks pretty cool. Um, I'm actually excited about it because that red coat does give me something fun to hunt for. Uh, are you guys excited about Genesect? Let me know down there in the comments below. And without further ado, let's take a look at Genesect in Pokemon Go. Genesect, a bug and steel type Pokemon with a max CP of 3,353, an attack of 252, a defense of 199, and a stamina of 174. Now the bug and steel type typing do make it pretty good as far as resistances go, however it only has one weakness and it is... <laughs> A massive weakness um, in the game main series it's a four time weakness in Pokemon Go you could think of it as a two times weakness but it's gonna be extremely weak to fire Pokemon so the fire Pokemon are gonna be the best Pokemon to go up against it now it's gonna be resisting grass poison bug dragon fairy ice normal psychic and steel so Genesect is a beastly beastly uh, typing there uh, just has to look out for fire now the ideal move sets when you run it uh, in any kind of like battling format PvP go battle league you're gonna want fury cutter or if you want to as a steel type attacker you can go metal claw now with the charge moves it does have access to hyper beam you don't want hyper beam uh, you're gonna want either magnet bomb or X scissor now at the time of recording this uh, there hasn't been an updated uh, raid graphic by a couple of gaming or leak duck um, but I did find this old one from back in the day when we all thought that Genesec was gonna be the next EX raid boss um, so it's gonna have the fire type Pokemon this list has not changed much except for the new number one Pokemon is going to be Reshiram as a fire type attacker and then um, you do have shadow Pokemon in the mix now but we're gonna head over to Poke Battler now and we'll go over everything for everyone oh and then those max CPs to look out for so for a normal uh, normals catch on a raid it's gonna be 1916 and for a weather boosted in rainy and snowy weather it's gonna be a 2395 over to Poke Battler here, we have Genesect Raid Counters. Now, first we'll show you with the shadows, and then we'll show you without the shadows. Uh, so, let's take a look here. Now, the best raid bosses going into it, of course, Shadow Pokemon, are going to do 20% more damage and take on about 17% more damage. Uh, so we have Shadow Moltres, Shadow Intei, Reshiram, Shadow Charizard, Shadow Arcanine, Chandelure, Dramanitan, Shadow Magmortar, Moltres, Blaziken, Heatran, Shadow Salamence with the fire moves. Uh, we have Charizard, Entei, Fra Flareon, Infernape, Typhlosion, Arcanine, Shadow Houndoom, Magmortar, Victini. I am not sure who's maxing out their Victini, maybe someone with the Hundo. Shadow Mewtwo with the Flamethrower. Salamence, Houndoom, and Shadow Ninetales. Now, don't worry if you don't have the shadows. All of those are great options, um, even as non-shadows. It's just regular Pokemon, but here we go. Let's remove Shadow Pokemon. You can do that in Poke Battler. Oh, then it went back on. All right, come on. There we go, toggled off. Alrighty and we will see that the number one overall is reshiram with fire fang and overheat chandelure dps monster with fire spin overheat dramanitan 
fire moves, of course. Moltres with fire spin and overheat. Um, if you do have sky attack, sky attack can work for you. Blaziken with fire spin and blast burn. If you have counter blast burn, that works too. Don't worry about that. Uh, Heatran, fire spin, flamethrower. Charizard, hells yeah, <laughs> we love Charizard. Intei and Flareon, Infernape, Typhlosion, Arcanine, Magmortar, Victini, Salamence, Ho-Oh if you have the hidden power fire, uh, definitely could work for you. Niantic, can we please make Ho-Oh better? Please, Sacred Fire needs to be really good. Uh, Houndoom, Heatmore, <laughs> and it just kind of drops off down here, even Rapidash showing up on the list here. Uh, I would hold off on Embor. You have that Mewtwo with Psycho Cut, Flamethrower. Oh my gosh, Togekiss with Hidden Power, Fire, and Flamethrower even shows up on the list. And Camera. Alright, uh, you guys should have some of these uh, counters here. Uh, so, Reshiram was just released. Uh, Chandelure's been out for a little bit. Uh, if you don't have these, just stick to the, your Community Day Pokemon or uh, all of these rated Pokemon. Just make sure they have the fire moves and you'll be fine. Uh, so that'll be the top counters there as far as this Genesec goes and hopefully you can get that shiny. Being over to PV Poke 2, see how Genesec does in the PVP meta. Now in the Great League, uh, to get a Genesec in the Great League, you could only get it through special research. Uh, there was two events where Genesec was available in research and that was the only time you could get it under 1500. So through these new raids, you will not be able to get Genesect under 1500. Um, but Genesect in the Great League is uh, has a lot of things to look out for. It's uh, mostly going to be there to stop the Grass and Dark types, and it also has play against the Psychics. Uh, you see some of the hard wins there for against Shiftery, Umbreon, Obama Snow, Meganium, and everyone's favorite Grass Hole lineup, Victory Bell. Now if we look over to where you actually will be able to obtain it in through these raids because of the um, normal and boosted uh, weather, you will be able to fit it into the Ultra League. Now if we look at the Ultra League, Genesect is ranked 97th and it will keep going up uh, as we move through the leagues here. But in the Ultra League, it has some key wins against Cresselia, Venusaur, Clefable, Snorlax, and Shiftery, which is a big chunk of the meta there. Um, but this is a mythical Pokemon, so it's only going to be able to be played in regular Ultra League, not in Premier Cup, uh, which is too bad because um, because it's mythical there. Oh, and also also because it's mythical, generally we cannot trade mythical Pokemon, um, but we'll see how they treat it. Um, now if we look over at the Master League, Genesec jumps up again, this time coming in at rank 76, and it's going to have key wins against Togekiss, Dragonite, Mewtwo, Darkrai, and Shadow Mewtwo as well. Um, so picking up those key wins um, because of the weaknesses that the other meta Pokemon have. And it does take out good portions of the meta. Um, being able to have that Fury Cutter getting to those moves very quickly. Uh, being able to spam off your X Scissor against Psychics and Dark type Pokemon. And then Magnet Bomb against the Fairies and uh, neutral for a lot of other things as well. So Genesec is uh, pretty interesting as far as uh, PvP content goes. Uh, I wouldn't mind powering up one, not yet making it. I'm definitely not telling you to go make one yet, but I wouldn't mind powering one up to test out in some Ultra. Uh, Masters, I'm not 100% sure yet because again, it is a mythical type Pokemon. So, it, it, I'm sorry, it is a mythical Pokemon. So it's gonna definitely only be able to be allowed in regular Masters and not Premier Cup. But definitely has play in Pokemon Go PvP. Only has to really look out for fire. It's, it's four times weakness is gonna come to that fire type. Alrighty trainers, there you have it. Genesect in Pokemon Go. Are we hyped about Genesect? What do you think about Genesect? Let me know down there in the comment section below. And if you can, please subscribe. Uh, it does really help me going. Uh, we're almost at 400. We're so close to 400 subscribers. So if you like this video, please drop a like, subscribe. And until next time, trainers, gotta catch them all. A Pokemon from 300 million years ago has been restored into the present day.
Genesect.